Where does that leave free will? Because we all think we have a choice whether to do things or not to do things. Yes. Well, you see, we, we leaves it in the position of, of a fiction. We have, we have uh, assumed somehow or other that these internal states, feelings, and so on, have initiated something. They have started something. They have created. We, 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 we have done something in, vo in a voluntary way. We have willed to act. If you now look at the actual history, we find that there are external reasons why this has happened. In other words, by discovering the causes of behavior, we, we can dispose of the imagined internal cause. We dispose of free will as a, an American divine of the 18th century, Jonathan Edwards, did. He said, we believe in free will because we know about our behavior, but not about its causes. And of course, it's, a sci it's, it's the, the object of a science of behavior to discover causes. And once you have found those causes, there is less you need to attribute to an internal act of will, and eventually, I think, we need to attribute nothing to it.